Hi! In this tutorial, we'll take a look at the different screen transitions available in Proto.io. Among other things, Proto.io offers the ability to create prototypes that look and feel real, with screen transitions being essential to this process. Let's begin! Our project has two screens, and we want our prototype to change screens when the Buy button is pressed. To add an interaction, just drag and drop a connection from the Interaction Wizard icon onto the Order Details screen. By default, all newly set up interactions come with the No Transition option selected. That means that screen to screen transitions happen with no animation. To change that, we'll edit the interaction and choose the Slide Left transition. Let's preview our project. The animation looks great, with one small exception the status bar at the top animates along with the rest of the screen. For our prototype to look realistic, the bar needs to remain static. To change that, we'll select the status bar while in the editor, then enable the Keep Position During Screen Animation option. Great! Now our prototype works exactly just like a real app would. Aside from slide left, Proto.io offers a lot more screen-to-screen -screen transition effects to choose from. Slide right, slide up, Slide down, pop in, pop out, fade, flip, turn in, and turn out. Beyond these standard transitions, Proto.io includes additional ones that very accurately simulate the native transitions in iOS. These are Flow for iOS 7 and Flow for iOS 8. And for newer iOS versions, Slide Left and Right Overlay and Slide Up and Down Overlay. Finally, we have the Slide Left and Right Overlay transitions for watchOS. And that's it. Thanks for watching.